good morning guys hello and welcome to my channel today i am going to discuss with you big news that has come just after that draw concluded on 25th of june 2018 yes my friends there is a big news and big change in canadian express entry program and what is that change to know that please watch the video till the end and if you have any queries regarding that or any queries regarding canadian express entry program you can ask me by commenting in the comment section of the video so let's start and do watch the video till the end so the big news that has come just after the draw that is now the number of days for submitting the documents after receiving ITA has been reduced yes that's a big change when you receive an ITA from Canadian government or IRCC the time frame is given to you for submitting online documents every document regarding your experience education and everything like uh, letter of experiences and everything you need to submit online the time frame for that has been reduced earlier it was it was used to be 90 days now it has been reduced to 60 days a big gap of 30 days exact so it has been a big change yes some might be happy with, uh, with this news that as the time frame is reduced now the whole process will take a month or uh, less uh, rather than as compared to previous process and some might be you know angry as 40% uh, of the candidates submit their Canadian PR application after receiving ITA within 1 to 60 days and rest 60% of the uh, online submission takes place between 61 to 90 days that is that has revealed according to our data that 60% of candidates submit their online applications between 61 to 90 days so yes this might be a sad news for them so the time frame has been reduced to 60 days and i am going to warn you regarding something please read it carefully there is a warning if the candidate does not respond to invitation to apply that is the candidate does not submit complete application within 60 calendar days of receiving the invitation and does not formally decline the invitation within this delay what does it mean to say this 60 days time you have been given if you do not respond to that yeah, that is if you do not completely submit the application the documentation and if you do not decline that also the invitation will expire that is your the ita you receive will expire and the candidate will no longer be in the express entry pool you will no longer remain in the express entry pool you will be out for 60 days and you have to wait you have to reapply for express entry pool again and wait for your turn to cut uh, clear the cut a crs score and then receive the ita the whole process will begin again and again so it will be a big headache for you if you do not complete your application after receiving ITA within 60 days. It, it has been issued just 3 days ago so please be alert all the time latest news regarding Canadian PR. You have to receive them. You have to know about them if you are, you are serious about Canadian PR immigration. So this new rule is applicable after 26th of june 2018 yes uh, this new new rule is applicable only after 26th june that is the candidates who have received ita before 26th june will have 90 days to submit their online application and can uh, ita receiving uh, received after 26th of june will have 60 days to submit their IT, uh, online application after receiving ITAs 
so upcoming ita uh, like uh, upcoming draw will have 60 days like in the month of july those candidates who will be receiving uh, in ita's in the month of july will have 60 days to cover the online application so those who are in awaiting in the month of july please be advanced and please prepare your documents in advance so that you cannot delay the application so that you go through the PR process smoothly and you get the PR and you fly to Canada easily. So that was a big change in the Express Entry program. That, uh, that was the news uh, that has come just after the Express Entry draw on 26th of, 25th of June 2018 so that's from all from my side if you have any doubts any queries regarding this change or if you have any queries regarding canadian express entry program you can ask me you can ask me in the comment section of the video if you like this video please like it comment it and share it and do subscribe my channel thanks for watching the video bye bye